behind the Hi. scenes of qual vlogging. Hi everyone. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to a new video. Today's video is so exciting because we are going to Qua and Karen's new restaurant. KK and Baby J, if you don't know who they are, they're a family vlogging, family? A family, they're family vloggers. And they just opened up a new restaurant. They already have a restaurant, but they opened up a new location and it looks really nice. It's about 30 minutes away from me. So we are going to try it today. I wanna to show you my little outfit of the day because I'm wearing their wedding merch. I just thought it would be nice. Kinda of go with the theme, you know? So I'm wearing these high-waisted shorts and actually guys, like around my waist, they're a little bit loose. They're tight here because the shirt like, when I tucked it in, it just, it was weird. And then I'm wearing some boots. I thought these were kind of cute. These are just socks. And then the wedding merch shirt. You can barely see it because of the lighting, but it has the date on it. And then I'm wearing my little choker. And yeah, that's pretty much it. With that being said, let's get on over to New Orleans Cajun Seafood on East Colonial Drive. I hope the traffic is good. Hopefully everyone's like at Playlist and not a lot of people are there. We'll see though. Let's go. Okay, so I'm on my way to the restaurant and I'm taking tolls. I normally don't take tolls but I kind of left later than I thought I was going to. So I was like, you know what? I'll just take tolls because it's not that big of a deal. Florida, we have tolls instead of like state tax. So that's kind of annoying, but that's okay. I'm going to this event or like this fall meetup alone. And it's gonna be awkward. Like I hope I meet a friend there. Maybe I will. So I'm just thinking positive, but like I don't want to be just like sitting there randomly and then at least vlogging's not gonna be weird. Well, hopefully not, because I mean, they're YouTubers and stuff. So I'm hoping that it's not awkward like it would be in a normal scenario out in public, like pulling out a camera and talking to it. I have the tripod on right now on the camera and everything. So hopefully it's not gonna be weird. I have no idea what to expect, but I think it'll be fun. And honestly, since Qua always talks about Fa in the vlogs, I just really wanna try it, you know? Is it really good? I'm a really picky eater, so I'm hoping that I'll like it. I'm excited. Also, I'm starving because I haven't eaten today and it's like two, like a little past two. I don't even know why I haven't eaten. Sometimes I just eat really, really late in the afternoon on accident. Probably gonna order a lot of food, and I don't know even if this is on my diet. Not that I'm like on a diet per se, I just am watching what I eat, so I hope it's like kinda healthy. I know that snow crab is kinda healthy, so stay tuned. I'm about to get on a like highway, so I'm going to turn the camera off now. We made it to the restaurant, New Orleans Cajun Seafood. There's actually like a lot of people here, which I'm surprised. Okay, so this is what the inside of the restaurant looks like. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I don't wanna like creepily like film people while they're eating, but this is what it looks like. Um, they're sitting over there. Again, I don't wanna be like too creepy. All right, so I got my meal. I got the snow crab. I'm sitting at this table with Pa over here. He's talking. And then Landon. And Jackson are right there, and then Karen's there. Pretty, it's pretty chill. All right, so I'm gonna try the fall, see how this is. Claw sitting next to me, this is crazy. All right, so first impression. It's not fair. <laughs> All right, let's try this. Look how big this is, it's crazy. All right, here we go. Oh, sorry. It's good. <laughs> It's really good. Yeah, this looks pretty good. Food is fantastic. Huh? Thank you. Yeah, this is good. Amazing. Wow. Appreciate it. Mm. Thank you. No, thank you. Thank you. Man. I love it. I'm a big fan of it. I eat here like every day. Oh, yeah? yeah. This is really good. What's the broth made out of? It's a chicken broth. It's chicken. Okay, that's why I like it. Okay. And what is this? Onion. Oh, okay. And then these are noodles, obviously. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mint leaves, green sprouts, all the good stuff. It's really good whenever you're sick, too. Daddy, I got a present! I got a present! <laughs> Amelia? Oh. Did you oh. say thank you? <laughs> you're welcome. the third or second time that a perfect strand has come out. Like, look at that. Oh, that, look, that looks good. I know. That looks good. Mm, <laughs> so good. My hands are so gross. All right, so done with my plate there. And this nice gentleman, what's your name? Rich. 
Rich um, is letting me try one of his beignets because he says they're really good. Yes, they are. All right, here goes. I'm gonna do this so it doesn't make a mess. This is Olivia. She was sitting at our table. You probably saw her in the pan shot. <laughs> but her and her dad gave me a beignet. Are they good? <laughs> How would they compare it to New Orleans? What do you think? They're good, right? Yeah. They have more flavor than the ones in, in New Orleans. I mean, I'm not trying to hate on New Orleans, right, right. but like they're no, really these are, flavorful. These are really good. Yeah. I'm pleasantly surprised. Warm, soft. Mm hmm. And of course, powdered sugar is filling everywhere like it's supposed to. Of so course, yeah. yeah. Behind the scenes of Qual Vlogging. Hi, everyone. <laughs> we missed all the madness. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah, we didn't pick up the camera. It'd be cool to see all the pictures. Karen's going to teach me how to eat crawfish here. Tutorial how to. So you twist the tail off. And then, this is the tail, right? Yeah. So okay. it's like a little tiny lobster. So you just eat the tail. Okay. I'll get you another one. I don't want it hot. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. I was like, what is touching me down there? Come oh, here. Look at that. Sorry. No, you're fine. You just pull it you out. You just pull it out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But that's it. And, and then you eat it? Dip it in some sauce. Oh. And then I was like, I, it's like, it's like a little tiny lobster. It's very friendly. It's Can you say hi to my video? Hi. <laughs> Thanks, Jackson. Yeah, look at how much. Look how much he ate. I'm just kidding. Karen ate that. <laughs> Yeah, I had some. I tried one. Okay, but thank you. Making TikToks. How funny. Okay, so the meetup's over. I'm almost home in the car. I love this meetup style. It's just like more relaxed and you can like talk to them more and just like. I don't know, it's like eating with your friends. I know that sounds weird even though like they're not like friends, but I don't know. I just really liked it. It was really relaxed and everything and I met like such awesome people. I met Radiant Karen. She's like the number one KK and Baby J Instagram fan page, I think, which is really cool. I give props to all like the people that manage fan pages because I feel like they're a lot of work to keep up with. Um, even though I always keep up with certain youtubers all the time i don't know if i would have the time to like dedicate to a full-on page of a specific person which that's really really cool and i don't know i said this i think to i said this to some of the people i was sitting with at the table that it's like i normally watch your videos like either when i'm in the car or like eating those are probably the top time i watch their videos so well i don't watch when I'm driving, I more like listen and then when I'm at a stoplight, I like look down. So don't get the wrong impression, but I just like listen more anyway. But normally I eat and watch your videos. So it's really cool because it's like I was eating, but I was eating with them. So I wasn't like watching a video. It was really cool, really chill. There was a lot of people just there to like get pictures and leave, which is totally fine. I, I mean, it was a meetup essentially, but I mean, I like the more sit down, relax, try the pho. Um, the pho is like really, really good. Um, the one thing that, because I'm a picky eater, like I think it's the green stuff in there. It tastes kind of weird. Um, it's not like bad, but it's not like, oh my gosh, I love it. Maybe I'll get used to it, but I have some leftovers here. Um, it's like half. I think I ate half and then I have half to eat at home. I ordered the snow crab meal like you guys saw. And then this big bowl of pho comes out and I'm like um wow that's a lot like I thought it was gonna be kind of small so I could just try it you know no it was huge so I had to end up getting a container to put it in I swear every time no matter how many times I see them I still get like it's not necessarily nervous it's more like excited because I kind of relate it to seeing a reality tv star out in their daily life they're really like down to earth I mean honestly like conversation was like it was really normal just like anyone talking to someone. The people I met were really cool and down to earth. There were some people that were from New Orleans, some people that lived in Ohio, some people that lived in, some people came all the way from Michigan to go to Playlist. Well, I was like, wow. And then there was people that lived in Florida. It was just a wide range of people there. And the food was really good. The snow crab, it never fails. And I got to try crawfish. I was gonna say quaffish. Oh gosh. Anyway, and it was really cool. I 
didn't really think that it was such a little piece of meat that you would get out of it. It was like really tiny like little tail piece. It is really like a miniature lobster. It was pretty tasty. If you don't like seafood, don't get it. Like that's all I'm gonna say. But if you like seafood, I think you would like it. You just twist the tail off and then pull it out and then eat it. I know that sounds very graphic, but that's really all it is and it was kind of funny that Karen was like, oh, do you want to try one? I'm like, oh, well, sure. So yeah, it was like kind of cool to try it. I really wanted to try it, so I'm really glad that she offered because I didn't really want to get a pound or two pounds of crawfish because I didn't know if I could eat the entire thing, so that's what I was worried about. But now looking back on it, I think I could because you only get like a tiny piece of meat in it. So I think I could next time maybe. It was really tasty with the butter and everything. I also wanted to mention too that I got this really cute boomerang with them. I always get photos with them so I wanted to change it up a bit and do a boomerang with them. So it's on the screen right now so you guys can see it and I thought it was really fun and Landon was in it. I love him. He's so adorable. They're so tiny. I just want to like squeeze their little cheeks. Okay, I'm done now. I think I'm just gonna end it here because I kind of want this video to be like its own video. I don't want to mix it up with other stuff. So it'll be added to my KK and Baby J playlist. I can't believe I have a whole playlist dedicated to them. That's pretty cool. But anyway, give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!